Early John's locket? Yes, I still have it. I'm afraid the locket is not for sale. Relax, I won't sell it, but I will trade it for a favor. In the cave behind the waterfall, near the entrance to the ancient tunnels, you'll find an old broken chest, half buried in the ground. I hid something under that chest a long time ago. One of my rivals is very eager to take it from me. I dare not lead him to it. Go dig up the pouch under that chest, bring it to me, and make sure you aren't followed. Do this favor for me, and I shall give you the locket. Let's get it to her.
Ah, good. You found it. Excellent. Here is the locket in exchange. A pleasure doing business with you. Come back anytime. Here's the locket. She's a beauty. Let's take it to Nancy. I know where to find her. Want pirate? I've no time for Danny. Danny sent you. I've nothing to say to him or to you. The locket? He got it back, did he? Well, it seems he could keep his word after all. Took him long enough. I'll never buy Danny's pirate and gambling ways, but at least I can forgive him. You could tell him that for me. Captain, the time has come for me to become a true sharpshooter. My mentor, old Fisheye, can give me his blessing and then I'll be ready. He lives under the East Bastion up in Skull Island Fort. Let's go see him. Bonnie Ann wants to be a sharpshooter, eh? Well, you don't need me. Annie's learned everything she needs to know. She needs a better weapon. That Sparkubus won't do it all. I have it. Well, I don't have it, but I know what you need. Uh, you know what I mean. My old friend Adolphus had a Scaramanga musket. Scaramanga. Valencian, the best. Less than a thousand were made. Get that gun and you'll do fine. Adolphus ran off and joined the cutthroats. Not very smart. He was on a ship called the Old Chum. It's been seen up on Skull Mountain.
Rufus, Rusketeer. Oh, he roughed him up. We left him for date. We left him on Refuge Island at the end of Corsair's Channel.
you are welcome, sight. Now Yumba Potion will make all better. If you see fisher birds, tell them come to Rapa Nui to trade. But tell them leave Chowder at home. Ugh. She looks to be a fine musket, but she's in terrible shape. I know just who we need to talk to. have we here? A Scaramanga? Ah, oh, it's a shame it's in such poor condition. But it can be fixed. 
anybody else, I'd charge a steep price for this. But seeing how it's for Bonnie Ann, I'll restore the weapon as repayment for the debt I owe her. It's time to celebrate. Let's go to the tavern. We will put idols back where they belong, in New Water Mole's sacred hut. That egg? Outstanding! Now you need to get it to our pet training team at Bestia immediately. No need to go to Aquila. In honor of their invitation, the Eagles brought Bestia to Skull Island. Talk to the Lady Eagle on the East Bastion. You're definitely the helpful sort, Pirate. Cat Mavery was right about you. I hear anything else needs doing, you're the first one I'll ask. Make for Bestia. Very well. All are welcome to behold the spectacle of the Patathalon. I shall take you. Board yon gondola.
Welcome, Barbarian, to Bestia, home of the Patathalon, where we train pets to be as bold and brave as the heroes who love them. The tradition began with Aquilus, founder of Nova Aquila. He never would have defeated the Minotaur without his golden owl, Mr. Sparkles. After his victory, Aquilus roamed the spiral. In a distant realm of mystics and magicians, he made a fateful discovery. These magicians had mighty pets indeed. The strange food and odd rituals the mystics forced on their pets made them even mightier. Aquilus brought what he had learned back to Aquila, where we eagles mastered the art of pet training and brought it to new heights. This is the Petathlon, where the finest pets from all over the spiral train and compete to be more than pets. The best of bestia become legends. Bear your burden with care, Bantam Porter. The company you seek is within, in the Black Pavilion. to be sure, but we already have our replacement. The old shipmate, One-Eyed Jack, negotiated an egg from the Waponies. We're back in the races, so to speak. Hi, why don't you keep it, young pirate, to make up for your trouble? Here, let's get it hatched. We're a bit busy here. Why don't you chat with all the folks around the circus? They'll tell you all you need to know to raise your new pet. It's one of those piratical waves. How ducky! What's that, my dear? It's a newly hatched pet. How adorable! You simply must get some snacks once the darling thing is ready. Snacks? Oh my yes. Each time your pet completes a training activity, you can feed it a snack. Snacks make your pet ever so much smarter and stronger and quicker. And that helps them grow bigger. Here are some snacks to get you started. If you should run out, you can get more from the shop in the arena concourse. Run along now. Ah, you've got a pet, pirate. Hype I to open your pet roster and let's take a look. I sense you have seen much for one who is barely older than a hatchling. But most have seen much more before they learn of... Morphomancy. Morphomancy is an ancient art, essential to hatching and training champion pets. We can transform two pets to create new ones. In our morphing idols, only the best traits are passed on to the morphed pet when the spirits can join to make a superior creature. You may buy other pet eggs in the arena concourse. Bring pets and gold inside, and we will conjure you a champion pet. Ah, you some snacks for your pet, I see. They'll be useful later. To see your snacks, hit B, click the upper right arrow. Ah, so you have taken up the noble art of pet cultivation. You will find it humbling, but very fulfilling, I think. Long ago, the sages of Mushu perfected training activities to strengthen the body, sharpen the reflexes, and focus the mind of any pet. These activities require a pet's energy and time. Many also require special gear. Some activities may award basic gear, but you will need more. Training is rigorous. Your pet's gear will wear out. Please accept these pieces as a gift. You can purchase more on the Arena Concourse. You need two pets to morph them. Best come back later. 
See that little orange globe there? That's your pet energy. So, little sailor, you've been talking to the others about snacks, spells, and sports, eh? They try to sell you some? Bah! Back in Griselheim, we've little time for shopping. We like some good practice sparring instead. It's the oldest, best way to supply a pet, yeah? There's no better way for your pet to get snacks and gears than an old-fashioned sparring match. Victories help your pet train to grow big and strong. Quick now and be up to the arena. You want to talk to Proximo. Like the Giza Saga says, there's no meal for a lazy wolf. Oh, don't you be worried. Your pets won't get hurt at all. Sparring isn't real battle. It's friendly competition. All in good fun, yeah. <laughs> ah, you've got some training gear, pirate. Time to train your pet. Press I to open your pet roster and select the pet you want. Brought your pet for a sparring match? Excellent. Here in the arena, you'll put your pet's abilities and powers to the test. Decius, there is the master of the game. Decius has two kinds of matches. Practice matches against our arena beasts and pet battles, where your pet spars with the pets of other travelers. Talk to Decius, and he'll point your pet to glory. Pets who are about to spar, I salute you. Your pet's settling in. Did you know you can show your pet following you instead of your first mate? Click the gold gear in the top menu, then click Options. Now click the second joystick and set Follower is to Pet. Voila!
The Scaramanga. She's a beauty. Let's go put this musket to some good use. Hey, Captain. Mm-hmm. Hmm. 